Hey there, pal. Hey there. Oh, hello there, friend. What brings you to the Bayside? Oh, uh, we were just kind of wondering what you were doing here. Yeah, uh, this place is normally for shipping cargo. I'm just kind of surprised to see someone, you know, visiting, docking off of this place. Oh, well, it was the only place I could afford a boating ticket, so... Um, yeah. Do you, uh, blokes mind telling me where I am? Uh, well, you're in Hurricane Utah, friend. Is that on, like, the coast here? What? <laughs> Nothing. Why does your friend look like he's an ex-convict? Oh, <laughs> Spring Trap, are you mind explaining? Oh, uh, you can't just throw that on me. Um, I, well, I'm not on, uh, I'm not a fugitive, I'm not on the run, and I'm, I'm not really, I didn't really get arrested for any crime. I'm just, uh, I got beat up, and I just like orange. That explanation good enough for you. Eh. So, pal, uh, who might you be? Oh, I'm Pop Goes. Pop Goes the Weasel. Nice to meet you, Pop Goes. You already know Springtrap, and I'm Candy the Cat. So, uh, what brings you to the old U.S. of A.? Oh, well, all those old books, they told me this was the land of opportunity. If you were, like, a rich bear before, like, 1983, maybe, you, you kind of missed the mark by a couple decades. Oh, well, that's a bit of a shame. Either way, I didn't really have much places to go after what happened. Oh? Uh, do tell if you don't mind me asking. Don't tell me you're an actual ex-convict! Oh, no, 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 no. Well, hmm, this is kind of heavy. I mean, if you really don't want to say anything, it's fine. No, 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 it's it's quite all right. You see, back in England, I uh, owned a pub. All my friends, my family, we all ran it together. Blake, Sarah, Saffron, Stone, and my dear Menorah. We all ran the business together. That's a nice small town, uh, you know, all family-owned business. Um. So what happened? Well, one day I was getting ready for another great day with my family, and they were gone. Wait, what? Yeah, I know, it's crazy. They just vanished. Poofed. Gone. Couldn't get to contact with them. Couldn't dial them on the cell. It's just... Gone. I was left with nothing. And, uh, well, I figured I had nowhere else to go, so I decided to come here, start a new life. Maybe one day I'll cross paths with them again, but I've accepted they're kind of long gone. Was that a lot? I'm sorry, I told you all it was heavy. No, I, Pop goes, it's, it's not that, it's just... Um... I don't mean to be rude since it's his building, but uh... Can we invite you inside? Well, uh, not like I've got anywhere else to go. <sighs> Lead the way. Alright. Welcome to Candy's Burgers and Fries, home of a famous, uh, burger and fries. Oh, so you want a little burger and chips joint. Nice. I already don't like you. What was that? Nothing. Hey, that actually, you know, makes me notice something. What? You kind of sound like my sister. What? Your sister sounds like a dude? No, no, I mean, like, she's got, like, you know, she talks funny like he does. Talks... Funny. Wait, Springtrap, are you saying you don't know what a British accent is? Wait, th that's what that is? Wow, you Americans are dumber than I thought. We do not claim him. He's not even from this dimension. Wait, what? Yeah, I might as well just cut the crap. All right, Popcos, I'll just uh, try and shorten this as best I can. Well, uh, I'm from a different dimension. Big bad guy at the center of the universe. He's big and blue. His name's Scott Cawthon. Him and his gang of goons made this little watch that uh, allows me to travel between different dimensions. Oh my god. Wait, like, all that stuff from those sci-fi novels I've read? Th that's real? Isn't that stuff, like, you know, based on scientific theory? Hence the sci and sci-fi? Yeah, 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 I guess you're right. Either way, the reason this is important is because, well... If I had a hunch, you know... Theory? I think your family's been kidnapped, Pop Goes. Wait, seriously? How do you know that? Same thing happened to mine about a week ago. Wait, what? Yep, and, well... Considering that's when his family went missing, and I've had this whole dimension hopping thing happen to me. I feel like we were brought together for a reason. Wait, so you're saying some being, not you, traveled through different dimensions and kidnapped mine and Candy's family? Right on the money. 
Why would they do such a thing? We don't know. That's what we're going to try and figure out. With this, I put it in a new bottle. Soul juice. Yeah, I just put some stupid name on the bottle. It's Remnant. Super powerful substance that's used to power these watches that allows us to travel between dimensions. How did you get so much of it? Grabbed it off the grimy guys from across the street. They were chill about it. No, they were not. Eh, it doesn't matter. Who needs them? They'll be next way to Tuesday in a different dimension when we're done with this whole thing. Anyways, Pop goes, I, I guess this is what I'm trying to ask is, would you like some help? That's a mighty big offer you're proposing. Like I said, I mean, I think we were kind of brought together for a reason. Take down those multiversal tyrants and, well, save our families. I mean, I gotta get back home somehow. It's gonna be long and scary and dangerous, but I mean, I think it's possible. Wow, I mean, hey, what have I got to lose? That's the spirit, pal. <laughs> All right, well, I guess we'll get going in the morning. First, let's take some sleep. I'm tired. Oh, um, where should I place this? Put it over by the printer. Ooh, you guys have one of those old-fashioned 2D printers. Our uh, printer's not normally 2D where you come from? Well, yes, but uh, we also have 3D printers. We have quite a few in my facility, actually. Oh, weird. Yeah, the others kind of like making art here and there. I've made some things myself, but it's not important. All right, well, I'm here there. Good night. <laughs> Jeez, that was fast. <sighs> uh, hey, candy? Wah, wah. Um, thank you. Uh, you're welcome. Just helping out a pal of need. I mean, I've barely met you all, and you're all just accepting me into this like it's nothing. Yeah. Call it a uh, stroke of generosity. I mean, it's like you said, we ain't got a whole lot to lose at this point. That's true. <sighs> uh, Fritz, uh, how bad is it? It's not looking great. Tell you what, you're lucky that they can't legally arrest an animatronic. Stop looking at me like that! Oh, shut it, Toy Bonnie! You're the whole reason we're in this mess! Need I remind you that Freddy is the reason my tooth was chipped in the first place? You're the one that lost control and bit someone, bucko! Guys, please stop fighting! <sighs> Listen to the damn bear. <sighs> Health inspection's coming over tomorrow. They're gonna do a whole sweep of the place, and if it's not in tip-top shape, that's it. We're done. Huh? What does that mean if we're done? You're all gonna be scrapped. Probably won't survive the shredder by Thursday. Trapped! What about the rest of us? Oh no! Maybe this will finally give the oldies a chance to go back into the spotlight. <laughs> After all, we're not infected with that facial recognition technology. <laughs> Gonna need a goddamn miracle to save this friggin' place. Census finger puppet. That what we're doing isn't working. Really now? And who are you to judge all of that? <laughs> On my own merits. Many weeks have gone by, and well, we're not any step closer to finding the man who did this. In fact, we may be further. We're about to lose a home. Nothing you've been doing has been helping. I don't see you taking any action. Well, actually, that's exactly what I had planned to do. What? Let's let my boys handle things for a change. I'm sure they can make quick meat of that guard. And once he's out of the picture, it will be a uh, hop and a skip until we find him. Revenge is just a yard away. No, I'm not stooping to your levels. You're an animal, Goldie. Just a minute. Not listening to your primitive proposals. Huh, a bit of wordplay. Cheeky. Fine. You may have given me life, Charlotte, but oh, 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 I'm not listening to you anymore. To get a good thing moving, you need blood and just a bit of gold. What are you? Hello? Huh? How did BB go? 
I'm not planning on wasting any time with you. My boy has been telling me that a little green rabbit and a cat have taken something of theirs. Something we need to get things moving along. And I think you're just the right candidate for being a little spy for me. We need a little miracle magic. All right. You can only say three things. Let's hope it's a yes, because the next time I see you, if you don't have what I need... Well, eh, let's just say nobody else will ever see you again. Got it! Good. Good. <sighs> Abrasive as always, Goldie. Abrasive as always. I better get over to Katie's before I'm made into scraps. I won't even make it to the estimated Thursday date. Up like a rock. Ugh. <sighs> Morning, chaps. You only tea around here, Candy? I've got coffee. Ugh, I'll pass. I don't think where we're going, we're gonna need coffee, boys. <sighs> All right, just gotta fill up the watch and uh. Hey, uh, we put that bottle by the printer, didn't we? Hmm. Uh, I, I thought I did. Wait, where's the bottle? Okay, Candy, let's not panic. Maybe we just misplaced it. Spring trap, literally you and I watched Pop Goes put it there. There's no way we misplaced it. Either one of us stole it, which I don't think either of the three of us have a reason to do, or worse, somebody else stole it. Oh, who am I kidding? You're right. Wait, wait if someone else stole it, then what are we gonna do? Come on, we were so close. Okay, okay, let's not panic. Cams, I've got security cams. I'll go check the footage. Come on, spring trap. Alright, alright. Why don't I see nothing? Right, I gotta turn on the night vision. Alright, well there's the three of us sleeping. Nothing out of the ordinary so far. Wait, look, who's the cheeky bloke down there? Oh, you gotta be kidding me. The damn balloon kid from across the street? Ah! Wait, pause there. Oh no. We got a goddamn thief. Well, uh, technically, we stole it from them first. That's not the point! Well, what are we gonna do? Well, we gotta get it back somehow. Do we break back in? No, that's a death trap! They outnumber us almost three times over. We barely even got out of there once. Oh, they're hogwash at this point! I'm not giving up now. Not after we're so close. Are we sure about this, mate? Yeah, Spring Trap, it's kind of a death sentence to go in there. Huh, yeah. So it's either go in there, almost die, and get our remnant back. Or one of your two brilliant ideas. Oh, wait, you have none. He's putting on a little harsh. I'm sorry, or I'm just trying to be realistic, and I'm pissed off, and... Well, if we're out of options, I, I'd say we go pay the neighbors a visit. Right with you, chap. <sighs> All right, boys, I got this. Hey, wait a minute. Huh? Pop goes, why don't you answer the door? Well, well why me? Well, they don't know who you are. And uh, they kind of know who me and Candy are, and we don't really have a great reputation, so, um... Oh, if we hide behind this rock. What rock? Spring trap, that's a box. And? All right, well, fine. I, I, I guess if you two hide back there, I can answer the door. Um, what do you want me to say? Um, stop being big, stupid, and mean, and give us back our remnant. Here's something. Oh my god, you are no help. Um, <clears throat> see, it's hard to think up. Just, uh, tell them you're a part of the health dispectors. You know, uh, the, the, you know, they're looking, looking around to see what happened yesterday. Yeah, 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 you do that. The health detectors? Do you mean health inspectors? Yes. If I get killed, Candy, I want you as my best man at my funeral, and, uh, Springtrap, you can be the ring boy. Isn't that for a wedding? Just let him have his fun. Boom. <laughs> oh! Um, hi! Uh, um, we're closed today. Oh, uh, trust me, sir, I'm aware. Um, I'm a part of the health inspectors here to inspect this restaurant after what happened yesterday. Oh, where are my men or something? Please, just, uh, come right in and, uh, mind the messes. Uh, I mean, uh, mind the lack of messes because there are none. Okay. Um. You're doing great! Did you just wink at that box? Uh, no! What are you talking about? Go! 
you by some time. Cool. Pop goes is in there. What were you supposed to do once he got in? I don't know, actually. Shit, how are we gonna get in? Let's just go through the vent again. Right, I almost forgot. Uh, Alright, come on. Uh, 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 wait for me! Uh, well, sir, as you can see, the show stage is in tip-top order. Can't have a new one, just for this. Well, uh, yes, everything does seem to be in order. Uh, may I ask why your friend has his tooth chipped? Oh, him. He had just a clumsy little accident. Oh, you see, it was so funny. Um, how do I say this without us getting a health violation? Um, he was just brushing his teeth so good that he chipped it. Yep, the brush just smacked his tooth right out. Well, not his whole tooth, just part of his tooth. Oh, that's unfortunate. Well, I'm um, good to know that he's, uh, okay, I think. Um, Ma'am, is that a real cupcake? Oh, this? Uh, no, 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 this is just a prop. His name's Carl. He's very nice. Say hi, Mr. Carl. Ah, uh, hi, I'm Carl! You know, it's kind of bad that I actually can't tell if that's you doing a voice with cupcakes actually live. Ah, oh, whatever. Well, Mr. Toy Freddy Fazbear, um, this seems to be nice and tip-top in order. Um, I believe that you do have some other attractions here. Um, I am particularly noted of a small humanoid boy character. Oh, you're talking about BB. Um, I don't actually know where he is. I haven't seen him today. Oh, that's rather odd. Do you think you could lead me to him? Sure, I'm sure we could find him with a little bit of trial and error. Um, come with me. Right on. Uh, damn it. Uh, uh, I didn't know you old fredbear suits could still move. I'm no simple suit, night guard. You know corporate's gonna have your head for this. They're already this close to taking apart those other animatronics. They'll get you too. Oh, oh, oh believe me. They can try. Uh, uh. Hi. Ah, dearest balloon boy. I knew you wouldn't disappoint me. Now I can finally put my plan into motion. You, you little rabbit. Why do you bear the mask that my dearest friend once wore? I'll find your sorcery one day. Hey, Goldie! What's that? Ah, my friends. I see you've managed to get back that remnant those two stole from us. Quite impressive there! Yes, yes, yes. All by myself. Tell you what, it wasn't easy. But, oh, sometimes I just gotta get my hands dirty, you know. So, so, uh, would you like to give it back now? Oh, trust me, I've got some other things planned. Those newer models. Unstable, unfit for conditions. And that new health inspector coming in today. Yes, yes. He would be a great test subject for my new supercharged robots. Oh boy, oh boy! Ha! You think I'm talking about you? You're weak! Old, worn down. Sorry, fellas, you can join me for the ride, but this mission... You're benched. Ah! Hey. What was that for? Getting in my way, that's what. It's like I said, boys. All it takes is some miracle magic. And just a little bit of gold. Come along, boy. Unless you want to be left behind with the settling dust. You got all of that, right? Yeah. Yeah, I did. Goldie? Who is that? Golden Freddy. <sighs> Should've known he'd be here too. He sounds way worse than I thought. Come on, we gotta find an exit. Yeah. Well, Mr. Health Inspector, uh, while we can't find Baby right now, uh, this is Mangle. Say hi to Mangle. <laughs> Mr. House Inspector, you must have caught me at a bad time. I'm not all prepared in Kid's Cove at the moment. <laughs> oh my god. Um, do you mind me asking what happened to him? Well, she's been through a rough patch, but uh, we make do with what we have. You know, we want to be, you know, inclusive here at Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. Well, I appreciate that you all are trying your best. I just hope you know, they, um, are, uh, consensual to this whole thing. Trust me, it's very fun! Okay, good, good. Oh, I 
have, they have a plan right now. I'm kind of running out of time to stall. Get off! Huh? The one that started this whole thing! Uh, hey, why don't you, uh, conversate with Mangle for a moment? I'm gonna go check on the others. Uh, uh okay. Um, hello there, Mangle. Hi there! So, what's your name? Well, uh, I'm Pop Goes. Uh, <laughs> You're just stressing me out! Ugh, Chica, you don't get it! Don't you notice things have been off ever since that guy showed up here? I feel like my systems are all out of whack. No, n nothing's wrong. Nothing's wrong at all. You're just being weird. Guys, guys, stop with the yelling. The health inspector can hear you. Hey, I don't care anymore about the health inspector. What? Do you want our home taken away from us? Freddy, open your eyes. Haven't you noticed things have been off? They sure have been with you. Not just talking about me. I'm talking about with all of us. My systems are all out of whack. I think I can tell yours are too. Maybe you're a little right. Freddy, you can't believe this nonsense! Chica, normally you're calm and collected about these kinds of things. Just take a step to think about it. Maybe you're right. I just want things to go back to normal. How does this get fixed? <laughs> Did you all hear that? Yeah, it sounded like laughing. Did it come from this way? Chica, wait up! Guys, I... Uh, the health and... <laughs> oh, ah, oh my god! Oh, Jesus Christ. Dude, oh god, I'm so sorry. <laughs> ah. <sighs> Maybe we should stop climbing in their vents. G what are you two doing back here? Uh, it's not today. Why won't you just buzz off? Listen, I didn't want to come back here, Toy Freddy. But your little balloon gremlin stole all our remnant. Yeah, and we kind of needed that to really buzz off. Huh? What are you talking about? What? You mean you didn't tell him to? No! Why would I tell Balloon Boy to steal something? Wait, so if you didn't do this, then... Who did? Is it in character for Balloon Boy just to steal things like that? I mean, a little, but he usually just steals batteries, not whole, like, bottles of whatever Remnant is. He certainly wanted hot buildings to do it. I guess that's the one thing I never really thought about it with her. I never felt together enough to ask. You're telling me! I guess that's one thing we have in common, right? Yeah. Well, it's nice been chatting with you. I agree. Did you hear that? What are you talking about? Me and Toy Bonnie, we heard laughing this way. I mean, we were having a conversation, and I really don't know what you're talking about. Definitely wasn't from the either of you. I think the two of you would be referring to me. Hello? Who the hell are you? I am Golden Freddy. You don't look like any of the others from the back? Oh, it's just because I've played my cards right and stayed hidden in the shadows is all. Listen, I'm here to cut to the chase. I want to make a deal with the three of you. Well, the four of you, including Toy Freddy. I'm not sure where he is at the moment. Oh, well... Doesn't matter. Listen, I... have something to tell you some unfortunate news about one of the people in this room. That man, sitting next to Mangle, is no health inspector. He's working for the cat and the hare. What? What? How did you- You don't understand, Weasel. I have eyes everywhere. So wait, if he's working with them, what does that mean? Uh. It means I have someone test my new plan on. What? You see, I've got some super juice right here. I call it Goldie's secret stuff. I think you all would benefit greatly from it. Increasing your strength and your capabilities. Being able to rip anything you desire to shreds. Fix all the problems with your world in an instant. Ooh. Curiosity. Do I have a volunteer? Just a sip is all it takes. Toy Bonnie, think about what you're doing here. I'll do it. His tooth is fixed! <laughs> so much power! <gasps> 
This is great! <gasps> Come on, guys! Hop to it! I trust you. Um, Toy Bonnie, are you sure about this? Come on, Chica. Don't you just want things right again? You're right. <laughs> Guys! Huh? Pop goes? Crazy. Supercharged animatronics. Pop, what are you talking about? Wait, you guys know him? Yeah, we kind of let him in the building. So he's not the health inspector? No. Oh my god. What are you saying about supercharged animatronics there? Oh, yeah, friends. This golden bear fed them the remnant. What? They're going to kill us. Oh no. We've got to get. <laughs> Pop goes! Oh my god! Ah! Mangle, please! Pop goes, your friends have to pay. Hey, for what? Look, I'm sorry we dropped that vent shaft on you. We just needed this. <laughs> uh, oh, thank you. <laughs> Mangle, stop! What is this nonsense? Why aren't you on our side? What side? I'd love to be the judge of that one. G guys, what the hell? Who is this guy? Our savior. He's going to fix everything. Come now, Freddy. Join us. Don't you wish for things to be normal again? Oh, God damn it, I should have known. Ugh. Buzz off, Golden Freddy. I should have known. You knowing my name. You were suspicious all along. Who are you? None of your goddamn business, that's who. No, you don't! <laughs> are you fools standing there for? Get him! Come on, Springtrap. Uh, fellas, this is bad. Montoy Freddy, don't make us destroy you. Guys, we're, we're a family. Doesn't that mean more than anything? You're enabling the problem, Freddy. Toy Bonnie, I know you haven't always liked me, but this isn't you. This isn't, this isn't any of you. Don't you think they know that? It's those three buffoons you're blindlessly defending. I can sense it. The anomaly that brought that rabbit here, it's caused haywires in their systems. Something terrible is coming, and they're on the defense. So are you. Give in to your design, Freddy Fazbear! Wait! Kill them! Kill them now! Uh, no! Where is he going? Uh, I don't know about y'all, but I'm following him. Second thing, damn it! After them! Uh, what the? Uh, what the? What the hell is this box? This is where the puppet was stored. Golden Freddy must have trapped her here. Come on, let's help her before my friends kill me! Uh, come on! Uh, 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 Oh god, everything's so bad! I'm aware. I assume this is Golden Freddy's doing. Uh-uh. What do we do? Let me handle it. He trapped me there for a reason. It's because he fears me. <laughs> Waste of space. What do you think you're doing? Trying to move things forward. This isn't the way. You know this. This thing! This mistake! It's only made things worse. Don't you see? I don't know what it is. An abomination of nature! It shouldn't exist. It's only exacerbating this. Making it worse. Do you see what he's stolen from our friends? Your friends! He's not evil. I know it. He's doing the right thing. And for what? His own selfish needs? He's doing it for the people he cares about. Something the both of us should know well. Nonsense! I just want to see my sister again. Spring Bonnie, it's why I'm doing any of this. Spring Bonnie? Yes. She's my sister. And I miss her so much. Don't say that name. What? Why did you say their name? Because it's my name and my sister. Liar! Uh, Spring Trap! <laughs> Uh, 
done giving you chances. Is it over? A bit! Uh. Are you okay? Yes. I just used too much of my power. The same effect. Anger fuels Remnant. Of course. By golly, you're alive! Thank goodness. All our friends are just asleep. The Remnant was too much for them, so they passed out. Thank goodness. <sighs> Well, guys, we did it. Got the remnant back. Can we get the hell out of here before more stuff starts up? Yeah, we can get going in a few minutes. I have a feeling me being here is not good for this dimension. You guys all gonna be okay? Thanks for the save back there. Don't mention it. Thank you for entrusting in these people and not choosing to harm. The last thing I want to do is put anyone in danger. I'm just trying to get home. I know. I knew from the moment I saw you. Hmm. Well, no you didn't, considering you threw me out of the pizzeria, but- Okay, at second glance. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Um... Thanks. I'm sure my friends will get over this whole thing. I have no doubt they will. <sighs> um, could you guys give me a second? Oh, sure. What's he doing? <sighs> hey. You doing okay? What do you want? Uh, um, I just wanted to say sorry about all this and taking your friend's remnant. I'm just- How do you know him? Huh? Spring Bonnie. How do you know him? Well, first off, in my dimension, Spring Bonnie's a girl and she's my sister. I guess it doesn't come to shock me that this dimension also has a spring body as well. Do you love her? Oh, of course. She's my sister. She's been nothing to kind to me ever since we met. She kind of pulled me out of a dark period where I didn't really know what to do with my life. Um... I guess if it's any constellation, I don't know what happened between you and your spring body, but... If he's anything like Spring Bonnie from my dimension is, he's got to be real kind and caring. And, well, I think judging by how you've been talking about him, he loved you a lot. My Spring Bonnie was taken away from me by the man that did this to us. That's why I've been doing all this. I just, I want to know if he's okay. But this isn't the way to do it. I know you know that, and I think he knows that too. He'd want you to do it the right way, no matter how long it takes. It's why I'm going about the things, you know, the way I am. Realistically, I could ditch candy and pop goes and go my merry way home. It wouldn't take long, but that's the thing. They have families that care about them too, and they deserve to see them as much as I deserve to see my sister. You deserve to see Spring Bonnie again. Thank you. Hey, don't mention it. Um, well, I'm gonna go now. Good luck on finding him. Um, Spring Trap? Yeah, Golden Freddy? What's up? I want to warn you that I can sense something terrible is coming. And I think that it's something neither I or you can control. Just keep your eyes peeled and take care of your sister for me, please. I'll do my best. And I'll keep my eyes peeled. Thanks for the advice. <sighs> all right, the watch is all fueled. Um, you wanna put this in your inventory, Pop Goes? Alrighty. Wait, if we could do that, wh why didn't we do that the whole time? Shut up. <sighs> Alright guys, 
You ready to go find your families? Ready as I'll ever be. I couldn't agree more. Thanks again. Good luck. All right. Hey, wait. What happened to Fritz? Uh-oh. I think he may have stopped breathing. I'm calling dibs on his left leg! <laughs> Is there paint in my face? Let me just, just watch that off. Ugh. Oh. Whoa. Where the hell are we? Is this dimension covered in paint? Look at all the architecture. It's all old Victorian buildings. Well, we're definitely not in your guys' world anymore. Stop right there! Ah! Whoa! Whoa! Uh, uh, halt, trespassers! State your name and purpose. Pop, pop goes the weasel. Andy the cat. Brain trap the rabbit. And purpose? Uh, we're just passing through. Why do you sound unbeknownst, stranger? Are you lying to us? No, no, no. We, we, we just. Uh, hey, can, can we just get a quick uh, detour, a GPS? Uh, where are we? Yeah, we kind of stumbled in here on accident. Fool. Why would you go into unbeknownst lands, not knowing where you seek? Listen, we're just here because we're trying to make our way around. Just tell us where we are. Fine. However, due to the three of you trespassing under our Lord's Code, without a permit, you all have been placed under arrest. What for? On what grounds? The grounds of the Tie Dye Kingdom. Here we go.